Now we're ready to plug this in. It plugs in on the bottom here. You can see there's that little port. You're gonna slide this in and you may need to wiggle it around to get it in. And then you wanna make sure you put your cord right through there because it needs to go in that little holding spot to make sure that the cord lays flat so that this can rotate the full 360 degrees. Once you plug it in, give it a minute or two and then it will actually turn on and do that little rotation sequence there, as well as you'll see that the red light is blinking, which means that this is ready to set up. So now we're gonna move over to our cell phone to get this set up. If you haven't done so already, download the WISE app. You're going to need to then create a username and password and log in. We open up the WISE app and this is the home screen. From here, we're going to click on the upper left-hand corner on the plus symbol. Then we're going to add a device. Now we need to select what device we're adding. We're adding a Wise Cam Pan V3, so click on cameras. And then we need to find the Wise Cam Pan V3, which is right here, and we're going to select that. Now it says plug your Wise Cam V3 into a power outlet. We have already done that, so let's click next. Here we need to enter our Wi Fi network and enter our password for that Wi Fi network. Click next. It says press setup under your wise cam pan v3 which is right here so we're going to press that button until we hear it say ready to connect ready to connect we heard it say ready to connect and it gave us a little beep so we're going to click next now we need to scan this qr code that pops up on our phone using the wise cam pan